dear students today we are starting displacement reaction which is very much important for the board examination here in activity 1.9 take three iron nails and clean them by rubbing with sandpaper take two test tube marked a and b in each test tube take about 10 ml copper sulfate solution tie two iron nails with a thread and immerse them carefully in the copper sulfate solution in test tube b for about 20 minutes keep one iron nail aside for comparison kya kar rahe hain hum yahan par हमने थ्री आयरन नेल्स ली एक आयरन नेल को अलग करके रखा बाकी दो को हमने कॉपर सल्फेट सॉल्यूशन में ट्वेंटी मिनट्स के लिए रख दिया आफ्टर ट्वेंटी मिनट्स टेक आउट द आयरन नेल्स फ्रॉम द कॉपर सल्फेट सॉल्यूशन। कंपेयर द इंटेंसिटी ऑफ द ब्लू कलर ऑफ कॉपर सल्फेट सॉल्यूशन इन टेस्ट ट्यूब ए एंड बी what happens here the intensity of solution which is blue color decreases or faded means copper sulfate solution ka color dheere dheere fade hone lagta hai reason kya hai iska ki copper sulfate solution se copper 2 plus ions jo responsible hai blue color ke liye wo dheere dheere karke हटते जा रहे हैं एल्सो कंपेयर द कलर ऑफ द आयरन नेल्स डिप्ड इन द कॉपर सल्फेट सॉल्यूशन विद द वन कैप्ड असाइड हियर आयरन नेल्स बिकम ब्राउन इन कलर ड्यू टू प्रेजेंस ऑफ कॉपर सॉलिड ऑन द सरफेस ऑफ आयरन नेल्स iron nail become brownish because a brown coating of copper is formed on the surface of the iron nail when iron nail dipped in copper sulfate then iron being more reactive displaces copper ions hence color changes from blue to pale green pale green is the color of fe ions this reaction is called displacement reaction the chemical equation is fe plus cuso4 gives feso4 plus cu other examples of displacement reaction are zinc plus copper sulfate gives znso4 plus copper pb plus cucl2 gives pbcl2 plus copper solid zinc and lead are more reactive element than copper they displaces copper from its compound reverse reaction never be possible because zinc is more reactive than copper there will always be no reaction next is double displacement reaction activity 1.2 here when we mix sodium sulfate solution with barium chloride solution what we observe we will observe that a white substance which is insoluble in water is formed this insoluble substance formed is known as precipitate now any reaction that produces a precipitate can be called a precipitation reaction jahan par bhi koi precipitate produce hota hai use apan precipitation reaction bolte hain equation is na2so4 plus bacl2 gives baso4 plus nacl what causes this the white precipitate of barium sulfate is formed by the reaction of so4 and 
barium ions. Other product formed is sodium chloride which remain in the solution. You must know that the sodium chloride remain in solution. Such reactions in which there is an exchange of ions between the reactants are called double displacement reaction. In next activity, when we heat copper powder in a china dish, what we observe? The surface of a copper powder becomes coated with black copper second oxide. Copper powder ki jo surface hai, wo black copper oxide ki wajay se kali ho jati hai. Why has this black surface substance is formed? This is because oxygen is added to the copper and copper oxide is formed. If hydrogen gas is passed over this heated material, that is copper oxide. The black coating on the surface turns brown as the reverse reaction takes place and copper is obtained. CuO plus H2 gives CuO plus H2O. If a substance gains oxygen during a reaction, it is said to be oxidized. If a substance Losses oxygen during a reaction, it is said to be reduced. During this reaction, CuO is being reduced. The hydrogen is gaining oxygen and is, be, is being oxidized. In other words, one reactant gets oxidized while the other gets reduced. Therefore, such reactions are known as oxidation, reduction reaction or redox reaction some other examples are zno plus c gives zn plus co here zno is reduced and carbon is oxidized mno2 plus 4hcl gives mncl2 plus 2h2o plus cl2 In this reaction, HCl oxidized to Cl2, whereas MnO2 is reduced to MnCl2. Our next topic is corrosion. We observed that iron articles are shiny when new but get coated with a reddish brown powder when left for some time. This process is commonly known as rusting of iron. Some other metals also get tarnished in this manner. When a metal is attacked by substance around it such as moisture, acids, etc. it is said to corrode and this process is called corrosion. Black coating on silver and the green coating on copper are other examples of corrosion. Corrosion is a serious problem. Every year an enormous amount of money is spent to replace damaged iron. Our next topic is rancidity. Have you ever uh, tested or smelled the fat or oil containing food material left for a long time. When fats and oils are ex oxidized, they become rancid and their smell and taste change. Usually substances which prevent oxidation that are known as antioxidants are added to foods containing fats and oil keeping food in the tight containers help to slow down oxidation subscribe like and share for more videos thank you for watching